Let's do one more. What is 80% of 500? Okay, now this time we don't have the two numbers. This time we have the percent to begin with. And we want to know what percent of a number, what 80% is what, what part of this number. So 500 times 80% equals 400. In your calculator you would put 500 times 80, hit the percent button, not the equal button, just the percent button, and that will give you the answer 400. Or you could do it like this. You could change the 80% back to 0.8 by moving the decimal back two places over to here. So we would then have 500 times 0.8 equals 400. Let's determine how many questions we need to answer correctly in order to pass the state test. On the law test, there are 125 questions. You need to get 69% correct to pass. Therefore, 125 times 0.69 equals 86.25, which we would round up to 87. You would therefore need 87 correct questions to pass the law test. I'm going to show you one more irregular shape. This is called a trapezoid. This is not a parallelogram. The top and the bottom lines are parallel, but the other two lines are, they are symmetrical. In other words, they are the same angle, but they are going opposite directions. This one is tilted this direction. This one is tilted the other direction. The same angle, but opposite directions. The way we find that is we have to average the top and the bottom line. The top line, which we call base number one, is 14 feet. The bottom line, which we call base number two, is 16 feet. If we add those together, 14 plus 16, and divided by two, the average of the top and the bottom line is 15 feet. We can then multiply the average times the height. 15 times three equals 45 square feet.